this video as well. So before I get started, I just want to give a sincere apology and a thank you. First, I want to apologize for not uploading last week. I had what I can only call like a sinus infection because I was really hot and clammy and I was having pressure like in my ears and in my sinuses. I just felt miserable and it lasted up until about Friday morning. So that's kind of why I didn't upload any videos last week. I just streamed because it was a lot easier on me. So I wanted to thank all of those who constantly sent their support and their love through Twitter DMs, on YouTube, Discord, text messages. You guys are amazing. You're on my family and I love you. Thank you so much for being there for me when I was not feeling well. And now on to the review. This is the last final update with the Benz Gel 301 Acne Wash. And honestly, I'm very glad that I am done with this. I'm going to zoom you in a little bit so you can see my face. And that way you guys can see what I mean when I say I'm glad I'm done using it. Okay, so as you can see right here, I am like a big huge cluster of acne right here. It's so annoying. My cheeks have like little um, blackheads all over them that constantly just want to pop. When I put my foundation on, it looks like I've not worn foundation since Monday afternoon because it just looks so bad. My forehead up here is broken out a lot. I'm just a mess. Thankfully, in the last four weeks, the dryness this week was a lot less than it was last few weeks. But I think just having to wash my face so much really, really messed up my skin because you have to wash your face to get off your makeup and then wash with the Benz Gel Wash and then wash your face with a non-acne medication wash to use the gel. And you're supposed to use the acne gel at night and it says to use the acne wash twice a day. So doing that really dried out my skin. I think that might have been what really messed up the pH level of my skin. That's why I'm breaking out. I am already ordered more retinoid, lactic acid, glycolic acid. All of those good things are on their way. I cannot wait to flourish and lavish my skin again. I still want to send Benz Gel a huge thank you. This was not sent to me as a promise for our product review. I was not paid to give a positive or a negative review on it. I was simply, simply sent it to see if I wanted to try it out. There was no other request in the background that I had to do with it. So I really want to thank them for reaching out to me as a smaller creator and as a no name to try out their products. So it may work for other people, but for my skin it was a no. So that is the end of this series. Monday's videos will return probably either no Monday uploads at all or I will do skin masks and other treatments. Um, I don't think I'm gonna do any more treatments like this for a while, just to give my skin kind of a rest. So that is about it, you guys. Four weeks after using this, I'm not satisfied. I will not be buying it again. I was really hoping to see more of a result. I really wanted to have like smooth, clear skin. Unfortunately, that did not happen. Someone else, it may work for you. So I will still link the brand down below. So yeah, guys, I'm gonna get going. I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please hit that like button, subscribe if you haven't already, and if you haven't already, come on now. And if you want to join my hashtag butterfly squad, make sure you ring my bell because that way you'll be notified every time I upload new videos. I upload every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday at 9 a.m. Pacific, and on Monday afternoons, I go live around 2 to 30 p.m. playing Let's Play Mondays. I will not be going live this afternoon because it is Labor Day. I am going to be spending the day with my husband. I apologize. But I may possibly be doing some graveyard shift streams this week. I will let you know on Twitter, blindly honest, if I do. And on Friday nights around 7.30, 8 o'clock, I go live with Beauty Chats with Jen, which is just a hangout fun chat. Last week I did drunk no sleep story, scary stories that kind of turned into a Q&A slash drunk hangout stream. Whatever happens, happens, all right? <laughs> And if you guys do not already know, I have merch, I have t-shirts and stickers. Those links are posted in the description box down below along with my Patreon and my affiliate codes. So if you would like to help out my channel in any way, that is where you can do it. So with that, I'm gonna get going. I wish you guys lots of love and whiskers and I will see you in the next one. Love you, bye. What if I told you I couldn't stay, take me or leave me? You can still walk away
Dreaded clock.